Glorious morning. Makes me sick. Wahoo! Yahoo!
Yeah. Let's dance, bitches. Also, the power of friendship. Oh, rainbows and puppies and unicorns and stickers and shit. Oh, Jesus, I haven't felt this good in years. A piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Hello, everybody. Game player Ursin. Hello. Danny, I see you down there. You look like a Lisa Frank serial killer. <laughs> I forgot about that one. <laughs> Thank you. Well, I couldn't have done it without my fabulous teammates here. So wave to the camera, Jesse and Daniel. Wait, there goes Jesse's wave. <laughs> oh, I love you guys. Thank you so much. This, is, this was a great moment. <laughs> Jesse is the one with the witch hat, right? Yes, of course, Jesse would be the one with the witch hat. <laughs> <laughs> that was the first piece of gear. I'm like, I'm going to make sure I wear this one. Nice. Mm hmm. Hmm. That did prove that I ate it. That was a sugar cookie kiss, by the way. And I had Archie up earlier. <clears throat> but uh, just to save on RAM and such. This stuff's been going wonky with the codec. Is he? Is he now? Did he change something about his appearance from earlier in the stream? Do I need to go quickly check it out, as if I'm not already? <laughs> A lot. Okay, he's still wearing the same shit. All right, cool. Um, so sometimes I'll have two lurks, plus my, um, dashboard, then on the mm, monitor on the right, I have OBS, and then I have Mix It Up, Stream Avatars, Stream Deck, my camera, Pokemon Timer app, iTunes, and then I used to have the Elgato software, but then I just started going straight into the t into the middle monitor from the capture card. So, oh yes, it will. <laughs> it most definitely will. And yes, Ursine, you do need to try them. They are good. So what it is, is it's the white cream, and it's sugar cookie flavored white cream. With little color red and green sugar cookie bits. 
I mean, who doesn't love white cream, right? You know? Uh. <laughs> Man. And before you ask, it's hype sauce plus strawberry slushy. So strawberry raspberry lemonade. You could go for some I bet you could. I could go for a lot of things right now. I just had KFC though. Donators welcome. Donators welcome. He accepts deliveries in the rear. Anywho. Oh my god, did I just out you as a bottom bitch? I did. <laughs> Let's go to the sperm bank from Parasite Eve. I don't know if you want that sperm. That was the doctor's sperm. I don't... I'm pretty sure it was the doctor's sperm. <laughs> that doctor was uh, not someone I'd want to breed with. Or be bred by... I'm having another one. I don't care. <laughs> mm. I don't know, because he was a researcher in a museum. Like, did he have a private practice outside of that? Right? Like, now if it was actually David Schwimmer, I'd be like, yeah, okay, sure. I used to have a crush on him back in the days. I like dorks. What can I say? Life <laughs> But what lifesaver? What kind? Kind of lifesaver. The fruitier the butter rum. <laughs> the question. All right, so I can start the application, but there's still 14 minutes left on the complete thing. Get the butter room. Butter room. All right. I'm going to suck on that for a bit. I'm downloading the game. I'm downloading Star Ocean. I hadn't put it on the PS4. I only had the demo on here. You went to treat your mom for dinner. Nice. Hi, Rose. Mm hmm Donating as soon as they show. Wow. <laughs> wow. Internitas. Mom wanted to have tacos. She wanted tacos. I've had a lot of Taco Bell over the last six, seven days. A lot of McDonald's. Happy birthday, Mom! Tonight was KFC. Hubby and I are just drained. Understandably so. Update. Still alive and kicking. 
I think get rid of it. Hi Ludo. Hey girl. <laughs> I um I was <laughs> Okay Rose, no problem. Stop it. They're so hard to hit sometimes. Why did that feel like a freaking carnival game? Because it was like running side to side and, and we were trying to it. hit it with a Pokeball. We got the shiny though! And the alpha! I'm so fucking happy right now. What a fucking perfect way to start off the goddamn fucking stream. Mwah. Sometimes I think some of us need a fuck counter. And I'm not talking about in our personal lives. Because could you imagine trying to keep count at an orgy? I mean, come on. Skinny you curses a lot. <laughs> Producer regular you curses a lot too. Depends on how many uh how many drinks you've had and how much you've smoked. <laughs> Right, exactly. We were talking about that what yeah last night, yesterday. Oh, lots of shade, baby. Lots of shade. I cast a wide shadow. <laughs> no, and like I said, I only tried because of mom. Mom was getting on my case until I said it's my space, it's my channel, I'm gonna do what the fuck I want. And now with Twitch's things, you know, where you can set up so that there's a warning for that, I love it. Absolutely love it. Mmm. That was a good dessert. That was a good dessert. You shape like a deep breath. I didn't see that one. I didn't see that one on the, the, the videos I downloaded to make my clips. I might have, I might have grabbed that one if I had. Oh, come on, Slipper. Oh my god. Slipper's being an asshole. Mystique was the most, I, I saw that. <laughs> So, season 16 in a few weeks, one month. Are we ready to not be able to watch it? At least that's how I, it is for me. I'm gonna have to figure out how to get MTV on an app or something or I know, right? Nope, still on MTV. It has been a year. Wow, present trap? Okay. It feels that way, but from filming to filming, it's a year. Because from finale to finale, it's about it's definitely a year in between, give or take. Hmm. I'll have to look into it. <laughs> I doubt they're going to take as long to put it on Paramount this time, though. 
because if they're smart, they won't make it hour episodes. They'll make it hour and a half. Because that would take so long to get it on Paramount Plus for season 15. Because they had to re-edit season 15. So. Or for most of it. Probably other franchises. I got it. Yeah, I'll have to take a look into it. Because I just. I also need to see what I can get on the TV. Itself. Because. That's the one thing. One of the one things that my hubby and I like to do. Together is watch Drag Race. But we'll see. We'll see. Um, I just realized something. Hang, hang on. <laughs> oh, that's better. <laughs> Yeah, uh, we <laughs> other drag race shows. Hey, quinning queens kind of works, you know. We're quinning. Uh, <laughs> oh, what's wrong with me? Uh, other than pure exhaustion. So, I think we're going to start over again. I know we did the demo. I know we just played through the demo. But I think we're going to start over again. Um, and there are some things I want to do, some things I want to be aware of, because there are some characters I want to get that I've never had before, and stuff like that. Um... Definitely characters I've never had on stream before. And I know that there's some plot points I have to hit and people I can't have, etc., etc. Six months behind on a. No, nah, that's not. I mean, okay. Look at it this way most people don't have their housewarming party until they've completely unpacked and are settled. I moved back in here in 2016, and I'm still not completely unpacked. <laughs> so. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I never will be completely unpacked. There's not enough room. But. <laughs> Just saying. Have a housewarming, like remodel. I mean, why not have a grand reopening? <laughs> oh, that was like the sluttiest thing I've said tonight. Have a grand reopening, get it? <laughs> uh, oh, uh, sorry, my mind's in a weird place. Uh, for those of you that don't know, uh, we're going through a lot right now, family wise. Uh, my mother-in-law was just put into an end-of-life care facility. And, um, so yeah. Basically, we're waiting for all her organs to shut down and for her to go. Trying to find polite ways of, of saying, why aren't you dead yet, is getting interesting. Of course, I'm joking. But, uh, you know, and it's time. I have to make sure you have a good time. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, it's just one of those things. And it's like, you know, tonight, you know, Jason got home from work. He did overtime. And I was just like, honey, do you want to go or not? He goes, no, I really am tired. 
you know so i was like okay okay um are you sure and then you know i made sure to reiterate you know what happens if you don't go visit she passes tonight how are you gonna feel you know, I'm, I'm just trying to be, you know, the voice of reason, basically, as far as stuff like that goes. You know, that's really all it can be. Um, because I personally don't handle hospitals all that well, but now that she's in a, a facility, it might be better for me to handle. You know what I mean? I know that sounds weird, sounds selfish, but I spent a lot of time in the waiting room and not in the room with my mother-in-law this weekend just because I would start to get a panic or an anxiety attack. And I would just excuse myself and say, I'm just going to go to the waiting room. I'll just be right down the hall. It was literally right down the hall. You walk down down the hall from straight from the door. The doorway was at the T-junction, right at the nurse's station. So it was perfect, you know? But, uh, yep. And then yesterday we transferred her from San Francisco up to Vallejo, which is about an hour and it'll only take it'll only take us about 20 to 30 minutes depending on traffic instead of uh, an hour to three hours depending on traffic uh, so like yesterday being stuck in two and a half hours of traffic sucks ass oh and if anybody's wondering no i did not change the name of the bot casuals bot minion has died twitch banned him uh, apparently my bot got banned for spamming in the chat. And I'm like, who the fuck banned my bot for spamming in the chat of my own goddamn channel? I don't know if someone reported it, but or if Twitch was just keeping an eye on I don't know. I have no idea. And I'm just like, okay, whatever. So, and I lost the password and I didn't want to fight and I couldn't reset the password. So I made a new bot account. Fuck it. I was jealous it was here and I was not. Yeah, but you had your reasons, okay? You had very justifiable reasons, I believe, if it extended from that reason. So, you know, no need. But. Oh, next step. For Maria the robot got jealous. Yeah, you know why she's jealous? She's jealous because she's not in the shade category. <laughs> That's what it is. Oh, yay. That bitch. <laughs> that was like one of the best snatch game performances ever. Like she deserved every you know, oh my god. It was awesome. What a bitch. Uh. <laughs> uh. All right. Oh no, I'm in the wrong thing! No, go back. Go back here. That's it. Let's just have my full legal name on display. Oh, I love it. Okay, um, hang tight. <laughs> oh god, I don't know. I don't know who I would pick. I really don't. I really don't know.
And you know, and I've thought about some of this shit before too, but I just, I don't know who I would play in Snatch Game. I don't know who I'd be able to impersonate. Lols, <laughs> right? It's not gonna bug me the whole stream. We're just gonna be stuck on the opening um, and not get to the game because I'm just gonna be here thinking about it. Like, who the hell <laughs> could I impersonate? Because I'm also thinking, well, yeah, I could be a fat Mariah. Oh. <laughs> but, you know, that's not going to go over too well. Uh. If I could do the voice, I would do Roseanne. But I don't think the, also, I don't think that would go over too well because of the racism. Uh. There's a possibility I could pull off Bruce Valanche. Oh my god, Roger. Oh, I could totally. Dimmer switches. I used to do it better than that. Pecan Sandies. Um. <laughs> Great minds. Um, uh, I really have no idea. Where's the any button? Damn it. And there's my full name. Hold on, I gotta fix this. I did it wrong. Oh yeah, you used you did used to have that as a redemption. I can't believe I've done this to myself so many times. Okay. Their user is using it. Okay. What, huh? What oddish? Oh, look, y'all. It's an oddish. Boo, you whore. <laughs> Love it. Hello. Hello? Of course, right as I Eat dirt and die, trash. <laughs> no, I don't want to load the save data. Like I said, we're going to start up. First, we're going to do some configurations. A 20 inch by 10 inch dildo. You can set it on a table in the corner and call it Big Bertha. Or even get a bigger one. They have novelty ones that I think that are like four foot by two foot. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> yes, please. <laughs> what was it I said in your stream, Danny? 15 inches, it'd be like anal and oral at the same time. Bless you. Husband sneezed. <laughs> what do I get a little one of it? <laughs> little Debbie and Big Deborah. It's like a snack cake. <laughs> I think that's where I got my vibrator. Okay, what was I doing? <laughs> Look, video games. We're gonna play as Reyna. <laughs> yes. All right, English. We're on Earth difficulty. I love this. We can only get the new the uh, the PSP. Voices for English. Yeah. <gasps> good. The original PlayStation music for the new arrangements, which I prefer. I'm all for, you know, more CD quality audio, you know, as the adv advancements in technology and everything, we've gone from, you know, more of a MIDI arrangement to a full on orchestra recording. And that's what I'm down with. And look, we got bonus items, yay. Hallelujah. Right. Sixty-nine. Pride sixty-nine. Ooh, two snaps and a rewind. All right. Thank you for the videos. I'm leaving. Bye. Hold on, just a minute. Don't you what mom me? How about taking a break for once today? You were just there yesterday and the day before that. I know, but it's just that being there makes me feel so calm. There's an old hag over there eavesdropping. Come on, why can't I go? Because I said so. Do I have to remind you about all the crazy things going on ow, since that ow, sorcery ow. globe crashed down on us? You got that sudden itch right in between your shoulder blades. Just last night we had a huge earthquake. The animals are all going wild and attacking people. It's too dangerous right now. Besides, See you later. there's also a <laughs> just like a teenager. Ah, wait a minute. <laughs> Oh, well, you're child. rambling. See you later. What Bye. What she sees in the sacred forest is beyond me. <laughs> that was close. Why does my mom always have to harp on me like that? I'm watching I you. The sacred forest always quick if I want to make it Okie dokie.
It's so pretty. I know I said that a lot when I was playing the demo, but it really is really beautiful. <laughs> about the sacred forest just makes me feel refreshed. I think I'll try going in a little further today. She's gonna go deeper, y'all. Do you to them? So much about me. This place couldn't possibly be any safer. Look out! I love huh? the auto function. But I don't have to advance the text unless I want to. Big gorilla over here putting the smack down on us. Good thing I made it in time. Who is this guy? He's dressed all weird. And what was that light? He killed that monster in the blink of an eye. He sure did. I um You alright? Oh, well, that was a close one. <laughs> Just like Robert. If you don't mind me asking. Where the hell am I? <laughs> hey, wait! Oh, that scared me. He didn't have to get so close to me like that all of a sudden. But maybe it was rude of me to run away like that. Yeah, a little bit. He did tell me to wait, too. Hope he's still around. Oh, good. I was hoping you'd wait for me. I'm sorry I ran away like that. Oh, no, th that's okay. It's just that everything happened so quickly. I was really shocked. Oh my neck. <laughs> Scary, huh? Y yes, a little. Still, I'm really sorry about all this. You saved me, but I just ran off like that. Nah, don't worry about it. Besides, you did stop to wait, didn't you? Oh, I haven't introduced myself. My name is Raina. Raina Lanford. Oh, and uh, I'm Claude. <laughs> Claude C. Kinney. Uh, hi. <laughs> nice to meet you, Mr. Kenny. So, Mr. Kenny, was there something you wanted to ask me earlier? Oh, right. It's nothing that important, really, but... Uh, where am I? Out of water. Are you a traveler? Uh, something like that, yeah. Where are you from? From, from Earth? Earth? 
Where is that? Oh, come on. You know about the UP3. Well, uh, how can I put it? It's it's really far away from here. Really. Really far away. Probably. <laughs> Probably. A far away place? That's really amazing. Yes. Well, not really. <laughs> Mr. Kenny, once we cross this bridge, we'll be in Arlia. Arlia? Is that where you live? But, uh, are you sure it's alright if I just barge in? Of course it is. Besides, I need to repay you somehow. No, please, don't worry about it. I didn't do anything that special. <laughs> you don't have to be so modest. It won't be much, just the least I can offer you, so please. Coffee for doing the story. I love participation trophies. Here we are. Welcome to Arlia. Wow, it's so pretty. <laughs> Is it? Well, thank you. It's such a nice place. I like it a lot. Listen, would you be able to show me around the village? Of course. I don't mind at all. Rustic water wheel. Damn. Blah, blah, blah. He's not my boyfriend. This is Belden Church. We hold wedding ceremonies and things here. Father Marshall is a very hardworking man. Sounds like a wonderful man. Oh yes, everyone trusts him. Brandon, my child, what a pleasant surprise. I thought you'd be in the sacred forest as usual. I was there actually, but there were some things that... Even the creatures of the sacred forest have begun to turn on us. You must promise me you'd be more careful. Yeah, yeah, okay. Well, it's a clauncher. This house is home to a newlywed couple. They're so in love with each other, it's almost embarrassing to watch. Oh. Now let's go steal their stuff. <laughs> it's not a JRPG without a little B and E and theft, you know? <laughs> Oh, 
What one? Rena, why doesn't Alan come here anymore? Hmm. You know, that's a good question. Hey, Rena, who's this Alan guy? Oh, he's just a childhood friend of mine. He lives in the town just north of here. Oh. This is Arlia Goods. They sell all kinds of useful things for everyone. Certainly smells good. Oh, those are the herbs you're smelling, actually. Uh, herbs? Medicine and heals wounds, you know. Can't leave on a journey without them. Oh, herbs. Yeah, I didn't know that. You didn't? Uh, nope. I'm amazed you're still alive. Town Carpenter's family. He's got a big job. I don't see much these days, but I just watch the kids. Check in, on when, check in on them when I can. There's a putty on the air conditioning unit. Although by now he's on the windows. Strawberry jam. <laughs> Oi. This is the home of the mayor of Arlia. He's a really knowledgeable guy, but he doesn't seem to be in right now. I don't think he has anything for us to steal either. Oh, it's a baby girl right here outside. Well, here's my house. Would you mind waiting here a second? I need to clean up the place a bit. Well, sure. Be right back, okay? Oh, welcome back, Reyna. Is something what? wrong? Can you hand me your water? Something big Can has you... happened, <sighs> Mom. This is serious. Oh, really what? now? Just what could that be? I'm not exaggerating. He's here. The hero has arrived. What? The hero. The one from the legends. You know, the hero of light. He's come to save us. Reyna, are... Are you sure about that? Yes. He's wearing clothes like I've never seen before. And he has the sword of light. The Sword of Light? Right. Yes, yeah. he used this unbelievable light to save me in the Sacred Forest. It had to be the Sword of Light. Yeah, Richard. So where is he right now? He's outside right now, so okay, I'm gonna... Rose. Wait a minute, Reyna. Excuse me. Ah, uh, is something wrong, Mr. Kenny? I don't know what I think. Ah, uh, um, it's been a while since you left me, so I was just wondering what's up. Yes. Oh, my apologies. Would you wait outside mm. for me just a little bit longer? Excuse me. Uh, sure. Do you mind if I walk around a little? Oh, please do. Go ahead. Please, walk around. Get the hell out of my house so we can discuss you. He surprised me. Was that him, Rena? Yeah. 
are you sure we should leave him out there by himself? I... I think he'll be okay, but... Reina, tell him to come inside. That'll probably be better. Yes, let's do that. Okay, I'll go get him. You actually believed me, Mom. Of course I did, Reina. You're my daughter. Yeah, I don't know if my mother would believe me if I came home and said Thank there's a, a hero of prophecy that just saved my life. That young man I saw you with, he was walking around here all asking all sorts of questions. I wonder what he finds so unusual about Arlia. <laughs> I'm just an old biddy. This sort of sounds like Roger as an old lady. <laughs> the guy you're walking around with? He was asking some weird questions. Something about machines? I told him I had no idea what he was talking about because I really don't. That guy? I, I don't think he left the village. Your boyfriend? Can't say I've seen him. He has slack in a while. I wonder how he's doing. Oh, yeah, they finished each other's sentences. I guess I can understand why he'd want to leave. Especially after that horrible incident. But still... I, I have to be going. Y'all are done. <laughs> Y'all are done, and I hate your guts. Okay. Glad we quit. Hero. to keep you waiting, Mr. Kenny. Oh, Reina, are you done? All right. <laughs> Got Nat starting soon. We're going to go ahead and we're going to take our break. Be right back. I need one of those, um, things. You know. You mean one of those diddly bops you put on your, well, you know. Exactly. But without the doohickey on the end. Either you want a new bowstring for your crossbow or I should slap your face. Either way, I can't help you. <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. That is like my favorite joke in the whole game. Let's dance, bitches! I feel like a fucking ballerina or something, you know? Ooh, our HP is about to go up. <laughs> Was my I'm I'm usually uh, getting off just about now. Or excuse. Okay, I'm Kemp Sheik. Yes, Sheik. <laughs> it's like it's really it's 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 really. Bad. 
it's super look at this it's it's just it's <laughs> it's horrendific <laughs> No 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 What? Watching over all of Prism Island like some sort of stalker creeper. I think he's happy with it. I can feel him it I'm a horrible human being and should be cancelled right away. <laughs> My fucking god, you guys, we did it! What the hell? You can eat a dick, but a dick can't eat you. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Uh Oi, you with the mustache? <laughs> yeah, you. What do you think of me jar collection then? Pretty amazing. Hmm. Don't you say? Welly, welly, well. We can't just let you look at them for free now, can we? All right. Welcome back. I'm pretty thirsty. Oh, this is expired. Wonderful. All right. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> I'm just gonna try and get comfortable. We must be comfortable. Mom, I'm back. Uh, Raina, I wasn't expecting you two to be back so early. Just in time, though. I was just finishing up everything. Finishing up? What? Beast pit for a king. What's all this food here for? Doesn't it look delicious? I put all of my best recipes out on the table for you. That's not what I mean. What? Did I do something wrong? I just thought I'd thank Mr. Kenny with a nice meal. I understand that, but isn't this a little much? Is it? He's pretty young, so I figured he'd have a big appetite. You are hungry, aren't you, Mr. Kenny? Actually, I am, yeah. See, a real man could put all this away, no problem. So eat as much as you like, all right? Uh, thanks. Oh, Mom. One hour later. Oh, thank you so much for the meal, but I just can't eat anymore. Are you okay? You didn't have to force it all down, you know. I'm fine. I'm fine. I've got a cast iron stomach. Okay. I'm sorry my mother made so much. It was all delicious, though. My mother would never be able to do something like that. I have to punch it up on the replicator. <laughs> Thanks for the compliment. Wait, what? I'm glad you're happy. I'm gonna go downstairs and help my mother clean up. Feel free to rest up here for a bit, all right? 
Sure, that sounds good. How is he, Reyna? Stuffed. He said he couldn't eat anymore, so I had him rest upstairs for a bit. Is that right? In that case, now would be a good time to tell the mayor. It's dark out, so be careful, Reyna. Let's be careful crossing the yard. Okay, I'll go get him. Literally your name. Literally across the yard. It's not like you're going to grandmother's house. You know, through the woods and shit. What's all the racket for, Reyna? Sir, come to my house quick! There's no time to waste! Now just what is going on here, young lady? The hero! He's finally appeared! W what It's true! He has the Sword of Light and everything! The Sword of Light? His clothes are foreign looking too. There's no doubt about it. He's the hero from the legend. My goodness. Tell me, Reyna, where did you find him? In the Sacred Forest. He saved me from a monster using the Sword of Light. And right now he's resting in my house. I'm telling you the truth. What's more, he said he's on a journey, but didn't have any idea where he was. He claims to be from somewhere, but I've never even heard of the place. Don't you think this is more than a coincidence? Indeed. It is something worth looking into. Reyna, I know as well as anybody that you are not the kind of girl to make up stories either. Thank you, Mayor. So let's get to the bottom of this. First things first, let's see what he has to say. Great! Great! Why, why is it, how is it overloaded? No, 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 no. What's wrong, Mom? Why are you panicking like that? I... Uh, no, it, it's just that I've... Calm down, Mom. Tell me what's wrong. Is she wanted to know? I said it. Off the door? Yes. Said what? I said the H word. What? You told him that? So what did he say? I don't think he understood what I meant. Please be calm, everyone. It's all right. He doesn't understand what this is all about either. Oh, Mr. Kenny. This must be Claude C. Kenny then, yes? Allow me to say, I'm honored to make your acquaintance. My name is Regis, and I humbly serve this village as its mayor. Where's Kelly? Good to meet you, sir. Kathy Lee. Get it, Regis? Allow me to thank you profusely for saving our dear Reyna's life in the sacred forest. Oh, not at all, sir. Speaking of which, Reyna has told me that you are, at present, in the midst of a journey. Oh, well, it's hardly worth calling a journey, really. So tell me, where is your destination? The Kingdom of Cross, or perhaps the continent of Lacour? Well, I, uh... I don't a curious know. traveler indeed. 
Not only do you not know where you are, but where you are going is also yet unknown. What are you trying to say, sir? Mr. Kenny, if you will forgive my rudeness for a moment, I do believe everything you have told us has been a lie. You do? You are far from an ordinary traveler. Hey, that's, that's... If I'm not a traveler, then what am I? A visitor from another world. A hero of legend, hidden under the guise of a traveler. In fact, even you will agree that you are the hero of light who has come to fulfill his duty as our savior. Am I wrong? You're wrong. What? I, uh, listen, what would possibly make you think that I, uh... If it's proof you need, then let me share with you a glimpse of our world. It has been told in our history that when the people of Expel are suffering under the threat of impending doom, a hero will appear in garbs of foreign make, and with his sword of light, he will save us all. Your clothes are nothing like what we have, and you carry the sword of light. What more proof do we need? What are you... I don't have any sword of light. Of course you do! Like, you a used a blinding light to save me earlier. That? Maybe he really isn't the one. He's got to be. Hmm. I think I know why you're all confused. This weapon of mine, it's not a sword of light, although I'll admit that it's something like one, but still, carrying this around doesn't make me any kind of special hero. There's got to be some kind of mistake. It does to them. How can you say that? Well, I mean, I'm not a hero. I don't have any kind of power like that. I don't even have any idea what's going on here. How can you expect me to save anyone at all? You truly have no idea? You really don't know anything about the sorcery globe or the cataclysms? We're not talking about something that happens in the village here. We're talking about the cataclysms that have affected the entire world. It seems that you do not really know what we are talking about. Please allow me to explain. It all began three months ago. On another continent, northwest of this village, there is a kingdom by the name of El. One fateful day, a meteor crashed upon Aluria, a town located within El's territory. At first, people saw it as merely a rare and remarkable celestial event. But before long, a cataclysm took place. Great hordes of monsters suddenly appeared in the once peaceful nation, and the havoc they spread devastated the kingdom of El. There has never been anything like this before in our world, not until the arrival of that meteor. It only stands to reason that the two events are related to each other. The meteor came to be called the Sorcery Globe, a stone of pure demonic evil. No matter how you look at it, that stone must be the reason for the disasters that have befallen the world. Yep. There's a lot of dialogue here. And now, 
Just as the sorcery globe fell upon our heads one day, so you have also appeared out of thin air. If that stone is the source of the chaos, then we believe that only you can cut through the chaos and save us. But I'm just a... The cataclysms are still ongoing as we speak. Strings of earthquakes like nothing recorded before. Docile animals turning into fearsome monsters. It will not be long before disaster befalls this humble village, too. But I... I'm not anyone special like your story said. How am I supposed to deal with some kind of magic meteorite? If you are not, then where did you come from? And where are you going? That's... I don't know how to explain it. And even if I did, you wouldn't understand it. The only thing I can tell you is that I'm here because of an accident. And not because I wanted to be here. I just want to go back to where I came from. That's all. You must have your reasons. But you must let us know more before we can make sense of this. I know, but that's all I can tell you. Very well. If you insist on it, then I am sure there is at least some truth to it. We will have to accept that you are not the Hero of Light after all. How can this be? I'm sorry. This is probably not what you all wanted to hear. Not at all. It is our own fault forcing you to be someone you are not in the first place. I'm sorry about this. Raina! I don't believe this. He has to be the one. Those clothes and that sort of light. Weaker than I thought!
Whoops. I want to see what it is, although it's supposed to be strong. I did it! It's finally over. So hot. You were so hot. Hi, Zero. Speaking of hot. Got a little small in. <laughs> oh, damn. I want to two levels for that. Shit, hell yeah. here father what am i supposed to do no, that does not taste good anymore we're done for more father what am i supposed to do Please, keep your voice down. We wouldn't want Reyna to hear us. That girl's passed out on her bed. Excuse me. Now that she's finally had enough of crying for her dead father. I am sure this is just as much a shock for you as it is for her. But you are her mother. You need to stay calm. For her sake. Stay calm? How am I supposed no. to stay calm? I pushed the button. My husband no, no, is pushed the button. I pushed the button. Now you're doing my turn. I pushed the button. Without him? What am I... What am I going to do? I still haven't told her yet. Now that he's gone, I'll have to tell her all by myself. Can you imagine having to tell your daughter that she's not your real child? And the plot I knew thickens. I should have thrown away that damn pendant. Why didn't I get rid of the last connection to her real parents? She would have been mine, my real daughter. You need this sort of protein. Oh, cool. I am full of water at the moment. 
Oh, boy, boy. So who am I then? Raina. Mr. Kenny. Morning. Good morning. What's wrong? You look tired. Huh? Oh, no. I'm fine. What? I'm sorry about what happened what? yesterday. I didn't mean to cause a scene like that. Oh, it's Jesus right. Christ I mean, on a cracker. I know I must so... look really out of place to you all. Now that I know the whole story, it's pretty easy to see how everyone came to that conclusion. <laughs> You're cold and wet. I grew up listening to tales about the hero, you know. They talked about how the hero would appear in our time of greatest need and save our way of life. And, I mean, a lot of people well, are desperately in need right now, part. aren't they? All around the world. Mm -hmm. Having you show up just like the stories at a time that's, like this... What... I just thought you had to be the one. That makes sense. I mean, I wasn't sure. But I was pretty sure. Well, I'm sorry I couldn't be the hero you wanted. I didn't mean that, Mr. Kenny. It's not your fault. I'm the one to blame for being so easily taken in by the stories of the hero. I still want to apologize, though. I really wish there's something I could do. You don't have to worry about Hello. it. I hope you can get back to your home soon. I'm sorry, <laughs> but would it be all right if I stayed here alone for a little while? Put your claws well, out of my shoulder. Okay. I. Uh. I hope you feel better. See you. I'm sorry, Mr. Kenny. <laughs> I better get back home. Wouldn't want my mother worrying about me. I know you won't love it. I'm a little busy. And you're a little wet. <laughs> it's raining outside. You're a sight for sore eyes. How have things been? Good. Well, great. <laughs> That's not creepy. Alan? I've got good news for you, Reyna. I'm finally ready. Ready? 
For what? The stage has finally been set. Or should I say, our wedding ceremony is ready. Huh? What are you saying, Alan? I don't know what you're talking about, Alan. I... I'm not getting married to you. <laughs> You'll change your tune soon enough, Reyna. Once you witness my greatness, my power. I'm not changing anything. Power. What happened to you, Alan? Can't you feel it? The power that's pouring out of my body, even as we speak. I don't want to feel anything pouring out of your body, Alan, dude. what happened to you? Whatever. Take her away. Let me go! Fret not, my dear. Soon you won't be able to live without me. The stone has told me so. <laughs> what? Someone, someone get Regis, get Wester. Raina. Well, well, quite the reception. Meaning of this. Let Raina go right now. Can't do that. Alan, have you gone mad? Yep. Alan? Move out of my way, please. I will not be kind to interlopers. Let Raina go. Ah! Mankey. say this one last time get out of my way or i will make sure everyone here regrets it dearly let him through everybody this is not the same alan we knew i think he'll do what he says but reyna i'm going to be all right please don't worry about me I'm having issues keeping my eyes open. Huh. This is fun. It would have been easier if everyone just did this the first time I asked. Off then! Get in! Uh. Why are you doing this, Alan? This is terrible. And what you did to my mother. Cool off in here for a while. I'll come back for you later. And don't even think about trying to escape. I've got to get out of here. There's got to be a hidden exit somewhere. There we 
we go. Where am I? I had no idea. Ah, there's someone on the ground. Bosman, are you all right? Oh, Raina, why are you here? That's what I was going to ask you. Oh, you're hurt. I'll be fine. But what are you doing here, Reyna? I was taken here by Alan. He was going on about a wedding in some kind of altar. I see. Well, Alan had me build this bizarre room inside the Salva Mines for him. Guess now I know what the altar's for, I'm afraid. Something's wrong with that boy. He's got this stone, and every time he looks at it, he cracks this smile that makes him look like a madman. I was frankly too scared to go on. But when I tried to escape, this happened to me. Reyna, if you're the one he's after, you better get out of here fast. I can't just leave you here, Bosman. I'll be all right. I'll leave the mansion once I've rested up a bit. But you don't have that kind of luxury, Reyna. But... This mansion is connected to the Salva Mines on the inside. You might be able to find your way back to town through there. Now get moving. That's not okay. Second time in a row. I apologize. Oh. My body's just exhausted. I don't blame it. I don't blame it. With everything that's been going on. Let's see. Let's do shouts. If you're lurking and you hear yourself shout it out, just because I think you're awesome. Everybody should be following you. The pip. There's no need to come out of lurk. You're very generous with the knockbacks uh, for a ninja guy. I know. It's not even a knockback, it's just like you just knocked up. God damn it. In my face again with the face. You pick that up. Never mind, you don't have to pick that up. Just face it. What? So when you said just face it, that really wasn't what I was expecting to follow up, but that works too. Look at the, look at her. Her children are getting murdered on the beach and she's just sipping tea. Mm -hmm. Look at her. She said, I'm not parenting today. I've had it, officially. <laughs> She's literally ha having tea <laughs> while her children are getting massacred on the beach. <laughs> She's like, this is fine. I didn't want them anymore. Pet? I'm gonna pet him. He gonna get the pet to pet. Yeah, sure. 
are you doing? Yeah. Love the good boy. He's so handsome. Look at him. He's so handsome boy. Hmm. He does not like his face being touched. Reasons I don't play this game. <laughs> Cage over here. I race this baby park all the time. They say very nice things about me. They say, Cage, you do a very good job. Never got first. Never got first place. Never I'm the best at baby park. Never happened. So you know, funny. a lot of people say, Cage, how do you do it? And they say, oh, let me tell you how I do it. <laughs> oh, I love it. Wow. Grab them by the blue shells. Oh. <laughs> awesome. I don't know what to do now. <laughs> uh. Hmm. Why the hell not? All right. I don't think I'll be on tomorrow, which is why I played tomorrow's game today. Um, because I'd rather start up Star Ocean because it's longer than Batman. Um. And all that good stuff. Hence that. But if you take a look at the schedule, Batman was supposed to be today, Star Ocean tomorrow, Friday, more Final Fantasy 7, Earthbounds on Monday, Paper Mario on Tuesday. We'll eventually get to that schedule. Right now it's kind of uh, sporadic. I'm gonna play what I want when I want type of a thing because of everything that's going on. Uh, for those of you that wish to keep in the know as to what's going on in my outside life at the moment, uh, casual announcements within the Discord is where I've been posting updates. And anytime I stream, I give a little update in the beginning. Uh, to recap, uh, mother-in-law is on her on her way off of this plane of existence. Uh, we just moved her into end of life care facility. She was in the hospital since la since before Thanksgiving, um, but uh, last Friday they gave her hours basically to live. Said she wasn't going to make it through the night, and here we are. It is Wednesday. She's on comfort care, no more supportive care, so she's not getting things like her insulin and all that stuff. So her body will be shutting down. So yeah, that's where we're at. Uh, so that's why streams are sporadic and stuff right now, and why I, there's no Christmas tree. Uh, nothing. I haven't had the chance nor the time to do any of it, really. So, but yeah, uh, doubt I will be on tomorrow. If I do, it'll be a later one like this, but we'll see because... It seems like every time I do a late one like this, I start to fall asleep very easily. Uh, right now, yeah, it's because I am just, my body is tired. My body, my body is tired. Elena S. Tites, uh, whom I do not care for. Anyways. We're going to set a raid on over to Ludo. Ludo is playing Mass Effect Andromeda. Uh, just because Ludo's, you know, a cool guy, great, warm person, funny, uh, be prepared for, uh, loud. Yes, yes, so far she, yeah, we've got her pretty much sedated for the most part. Today we took a day for ourselves, uh, to kind of recharge, and I just hope that wasn't a mistake. 
Uh, Tsunami Sumo, hello, and also goodbye, because we are heading on our way out. But thank you for stopping in. I really do appreciate it. Um, this is just a short one tonight. <laughs> I just, I need, I, I started falling asleep. Thank you for the follow, I appreciate it, especially because we get to see the guy from Imagine Dragons, you know, with his chest out. Mm, gotta love it. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna take us on over to Ludo. Ludo's, like I said, playing uh, uh, Mass Effect Andromeda. Uh, he can be a little out there, but he's a great guy. He's a sweetheart and heart of gold. Heart of gold on that one. So let's do that. We're gonna start the raid. Here's some raid messages for you guys. We got the top one for subscribers, bottom one for non subs. I want to say thank you very much for hanging out. And I will catch you guys on the next one. Until then, remember to keep it casual. Bye-bye now.